Welcome back to Window Cleaning Resource. I'm Jordy, and in this episode, I'm going to go head to head with my man, Window Joe. Thanks for watching windowcleaner.com. The work is the work. Well, Joe, you make some good points. A WCR video team face off. Yes, of course. 80% of it is confidence. The way I look at the situation is... Here's the thing when you're starting out. However many business cards you got. Your focus... Say you got 500 business cards. They can make all the difference in the world. 20 to 40 people called you. You multiply that over a day. You have probably made more than $100 back. And now your profitability is starting to increase. That's my piece. I've skinned my knuckle many times. And see how he does with that one. Window Joe. I'm Joey from the Window Cleanse. Signing off. So here's the premise. You're fairly new, but you do have some new accounts that have been generating income for you. And now you have some money to spend and you're trying to decide, I have $100, should I spend it on business cards? that are better than what I have or should I upgrade my tools? So my man Joe is taking the position of spending the money on the business cards. I'm gonna take the position of spending it on the tools. And so Joe, take it away. Hey, what's up everybody? Window Joe here. And uh, sorry, my hair is a little all over the place. But anyway, now me personally, I would go with the business cards. Now the reason I say that is because the work is the work. The windows are the windows and cleaning of the windows doesn't have to be over complicated. Yes, of course, if you had the best possible tools to do the job, they might feel more comfortable for you. You might like the way they perform more, but <clears throat> way I look at the situation is if you were to spend that $100 on business cards and hand those business cards out to X amount of people however many business cards you got say you got 500 business cards and you handed all of those business cards out to 500 people and on a low number out of the 500 cards say 20 to 40 people called you to do work for them. Now, I'm sure out of the 20 to 40 people, whether it's residential clients with one-off services or reoccurring route work service, you have probably made more than $100 back in the work that you did to go and invest further into your company, whether it's tools, more advertising. So that's my piece. We're gonna send it back to Jordy and see how he does with that one. Window Joe, signing off. Well, Joe, you make some good points, but here's the thing when you're starting out. When you're new, your focus is going to be mainly on the glass. That's where it starts. And so that being said, you're gonna to wanna to get better tools and they can make all the difference in the world. They can shave off five, 10, 15, 25% of time off of your job. So if it's an hour job and you shave 25% off, that's, a, that's 15 minutes off of one job. You multiply that over a day and now your profitability is starting to increase. So what could you get with a hundred bucks for tools? Well, you could upgrade, especially if you're doing storefront, you could upgrade your standard traditional squeegees with wide, wide bodies. You could get two wide body complete squeegees and still be under budget. You could buy a Ninja handle for about 40 bucks and a channel, 18 inch channel is about 17, 18 bucks wide body. So you could, you could test out a few different channels. All of the wide bodies fit into a Ninja handle 
and not only the wide bodies but the handle itself is going to be better than a traditional handle when you're trying to close out on storefronts. I've skinned my knuckle many times. You could purchase some combination tools. You could get a, a wagtail flipper 18 inch and you could buy a Mormon accelerator 14 and be under budget. You could get a couple of wagtails and be under budget. You could get a high flyer and uh, a flipper be under budget. So you could get a Mormon accelerator two completes. You could get a 10 inch and a 14 inch. Those tools are going to speed up your work considerably and you'll see the difference. You'll definitely see it and you'll be getting done quicker. You'll have a greater sense of accomplishment. Your confidence will increase and when it comes to window cleaning 80% of it is confidence and feeling good about the work that you're doing. And so if you have $100 that's why I say spend it on the tools especially in your first year. If you have 100 bucks, spend it on the tools not the business cards. The business cards can wait. Okay, so that's gonna do it for this edition, this episode on Window Cleaning Resources YouTube channel. This was a WCR video team face-off between Window Joe and myself. So let us know in the comments what you would do. What would you spend the money on between those two choices? Thank you for spending some time with us. We really appreciate it. If you're interested in any of the tools that were discussed or any of the products that or services that WCR offers especially when it comes to printing business cards postcards flyers things like that check the links below I'm Jory from the window cleanse and on behalf of window cleaning resource thanks for taking this time with us and until the next video have a great day in your business and we'll talk soon